We did this customer's Cobra 29 and the, not the hottest set in the world, even if it looks swish. And the customer said to me, what happens if I use a preamp? Will it be better on receive? And I said, I don't know. And I've genuinely, in 39 years of doing this, I've never played with a preamplifier on CB radio. So I knew we'd got one kicking around and this is a, an RP30 and you can attenuate with it, in other words use it as an RF gain control or reduction or you can increase on it. Well when I did this radio yesterday when it came in the 12 decibel synad reading was 0 0.7 when I'd meticulously tuned the receiver it was 0 0.61 well I have just done this with the test set on the preamp and we're now getting 0 0.7 for five microvolts for 12 decibels synad. So there is an increase, there is an improvement, but does that mean that it's going to work better? And that's something which we're going to find out on today's test. So I've no experience of preamps, it's auto switches between transmit and receive, but the danger is it has an insertion loss. So it, it, the radio is now going to be doing less RF output because this is piggy in the middle. So it was doing 3.6 watts yesterday, it's probably doing 3.1 now. So you know, this is... Yeah, it's Tango 21 loud and clear. Roger that, just coming up to the uh, end of the lane over. Roger. So, this is what today's video is all about. So, on this particular radio, which is slightly on the deaf side by today's standards, will this preamp make it better. Now yesterday Scratchy Corner was fine, um, it was a bit quieter at Willsford level crossing and then Kelby, I didn't quite tell what he said, I heard him at, um, uh, oh the next one, I've forgotten the next low, Grayley's and again I did hear him at, um, at Raw Spit at the end but it wasn't as good as most sets. So we're going to see with the preamp whether that improvement, and there is an improvement as I say Right, passing Ancaster service station Roger, got you at Ancaster service station So there is an improvement but will it be an improvement in reality and on the air so that's what we're doing today This preamp came in a batch of stuff and it was non-working because of a uh, a broken wire between the aerial socket and the printed circuit board. Uh, we're now passing through Ancaster Crossroads. Rather. Roger, got you at Ancaster Crossroads. Now passing the top of the hill, going into Wilford. Uh. Roger, got you at the top of the hill. Incidentally, I'm on the customer's power mic. Yesterday when I was talking to you, I was talking to you on a factory standard mic, over. Oh right, well, uh, contrary to what usually happens, I think you sound better on that power mic. Right, well that's good. I've got, I did a test with myself yesterday and I set it uh, to what I felt it sounded best at with the Harrier Bay station, over. And I've got the mic at three, which between three and four is what I felt was best. Roger, got you at Scratchy Corner. Roger got you going over Willsford level crossing and that's better with the preamp. Roger got you at the Kelby turnover. Roger getting you at the Grayleys turnover. Roger, 
Roger got you at raw speed level crossing. That concludes the test. Thanks very much. Yes, I know you've got the petrol station there. Yes, that, thanks for the test. That's fine. Um, 10 10. Yeah, just after the Royal Street level crossing, there's a petrol station on the left. And so, of course, it wipes out anyone who've driven, any of you who've driven past the petrol station, the computer equipment there just wipes out CB. And that's what happens. So he didn't say that I was a lesser signal, even though I know I was. And we did pick him up better. And I think that brought the radio more or less in line with an average set instead of a below average receive. So that was interesting. And so I've, I've had no experience of preamps on CB. So today, that's why I did a little service on that, made sure it was spot on. And as I said in the beginning, we brought the 0.61 microvolt for... Sorry, yeah, 0 0.61 microvolt for 12 decibel synad down to... 0.45 microvolts so there was a real improvement there so uh, there you go in this instance a preamplifier made the set work better so that's what today's video is about this little rp30 preamp which i bought off ebay a few weeks ago thank you for watching